Hello, hello, and welcome back to the channel. Today, I'm sitting here in, uh, man, in a most beautiful place. I just got through having a large meal, and I'm sitting back here, and as you can see, I'm working on my itinerary for my boat. That is the thing that I'm doing right now. I'm working on my 1989 Bayliner Capri. As you can see, I've got about three things off the list of 10 that I've done. And those things or the vest first things to get done were the replace the trailer wiring harness and tail light assemblies. That's done. That's checked off. I had to uh, replace uh, the batteries. I didn't have any batteries there. So I put two new marine batteries in there, 2000 cold cranking and batteries in there. Bought those from AutoZone. And I had to flush the engine out because it had water contamination in the engine. Found out that the water was getting in the engine from a missing cup plug or dipstick tube plug that went on the passenger side of the engine. So when the whenever the bilge would get full, it had gotten full, the previous owners told me, and it got all out, it got water out inside the damn oil. And that did that. Uh, we could see that they didn't have any breathe on the top of the carburetor or the flame arrest on top of the carburetor. So that was the way it was getting water in it too. So I had to flush the engine twice in order to get the oil, I mean, to get the water out of the oil. And I've done that and still a little bit in there, but uh, I'm gonna, it's not enough where it's gonna, it's not in the oil, water in the oil per se, but it's still, you know, you gotta get the system flushed out to get it out of the lifters and all the stuff like that. So gonna do that, let it run. But before I could get that done, the carburetor started to act a fool on me. So I've uh, removed the carburetor again. I'm gonna take the carburetor. I got it back at home. I'm gonna completely tear the carburetor down, completely blow everything out, uh, f uh, blow it out, flush it out, or uh, sit into my uh, 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 solution. And I'm gonna uh, take and reassemble it with it. And it's, there's nothing really wrong with the carburetor, but the top gasket. It's all wrong with the top gasket. It didn't flip anything, just the top gasket. And I'm going to uh, go on and put all that back together, put the carburetor back on the boat, and we will go from there and see just what it does. Uh, besides that, <clears throat> this boat this boat project has kind of taken precedent over uh, my other projects, which is working on the C-10, because I need to go and uh, work with the uh, uh, headlight on it. I replaced the uh, demo switch on it, but now I'm having a problem that when I uh, take and... Uh, when I take and, 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 and hit the demo switch for the bright, for the high beam lights, all the lights go out. And I'm, I'm also losing the ground for the turn signals out. So I need to go back and, uh, and backtrack on all that right there and see where I'm losing my ground when it comes to that. As always, subscribe, like, share, comment. Thank you so much. Your continued support is appreciated. It is noted. Have a great day and I'll get with you on the next one.